Hello and welcome to the CS Card video tutorial. My name is Alex and today we're going to speak about a product list. Let's begin. To access a product list, go to Products – Products. This page contains the list of all products in the store. To filter products by some criteria, use the search panel to the right of the list. The first and most important feature is the ability to edit product properties without diving into product details. Just click on a property field, enter a value and save changes. You can edit properties of several products at once. Just don't forget to save the result before switching to another product list page. Add products using the plus button or the bulk product addition feature. This way you'll be able to add lots of products at once. Product editing is also available in two variants – separate editing and by using the feature called Edit Selected. Editing in a bulk mode looks this way – you select desired products, choose items that require editing and then edit them on one page. Deleting products from the list works the same way as editing. Here you can also clone and export products. Cloning creates the exact copies of selected products. Exporting packs selected products data into a CSV file and sends to your computer. I will overview this feature in detail in one of the next videos. There are two more features available at the gear button global update and product subscriptions. Global update feature is used to update details for all products. For instance, we enter 5 in the price field and then click apply. What happens? The price of all products will increase by $5. You can also update only certain products. Just add these products with the add product button. The Product Subscriptions feature is used to track subscribers for out-of-stock products. When you update the number of products in stock, the customers who signed up for a notification will receive an email. By the way, to view the list of subscribers for a certain product, open the Products Editing page and switch to the tab called Subscribers. So, that's it about the product list in CS Card. If you have any questions, you can ask them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next eScart videos.